Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we will find the Laplace transformation of 1 minus cos t by t. Now, here we will use the formula Laplace transformation of ft by t is integral s to infinite fs ds, where this fs is Laplace transformation of L of ft. Now note that here we can take this function to be ft to fit in the formula. So here our ft is 1 minus cos t. So what is L of ft? L of ft is nothing but Laplace transformation of 1 minus cos t. Now what is L of 1? L of 1 is 1 by s and we know that Laplace transformation is linear. So it will be L of 1 minus L of cos t. And L of cos t is nothing but s by square plus 1. So by the given formula, we have Laplace transformation of 1 minus cos t by t will be integral s to infinite 1 by s minus s by square plus 1. Yes. Now note that this is an improper integral. So here we use the limit derivation of improper integral. So it will be limit x tends to infinite integral s to x 1 by s minus s by s square plus 1 ds. So it will be so by solving the integration, we have 1 by s integral 1 by s will be ln s minus half ln s square plus 1. And then limit will be x s. So by simplifying the expression, we get it is nothing but ln s by root under s square plus 1. Limit is x to s, x. So this will be limit x tends to infinite ln x by x square plus 1 minus ln s by root under s square plus 1. Now note that here we have limit x tends to infinite. If we solve x by root under x square plus 1, then it will be. So we will divide numerator and denominator by x. So it will be 1 by. 1 plus 1 by x squared and it will be 1 by root under 1 plus 0 as we know that limit of 1 by x is 0 as x tends to infinity so it is 1. So here we have ln 1 minus ln s by s squared plus 1. We know that ln 1 is 0 so the answer is minus ln of s by root under s squared plus 1. 